I think it's super, like, war is just crazy, man. I feel like it's just, uh, it's just so uncalled for and sad, so. Literally, man, like, these past few years have just been fucking crazy. Is modeling hard? Uh, yeah, yeah, it's hard. I, I, I get turned down a lot during, uh, for modeling. I get turned down a ton, actually. Probably a lot more than I feel like, I feel like you guys only see me when I'm, like, successful. So, like, which is super rare. Um, I'm in a, like, a position now where it's, uh, like, I'm not that special, you know? Like, that's the difference between like certain like different areas that you work in is that like dude i am i'm like not at the moment i'm not a i'm not even a successful model yet so yeah modeling is definitely hard it takes a lot of luck it takes chances and not blowing it and making sure you freaking look good and look the part you know so I work toward, I'm working towards that goal at the moment, and yeah, I mean, I, I believe in myself that I can, I can do that, and I will. Yo, thank you for all the likes. I didn't know you could go live with people. Damn, 3.7k likes? Let's get that, let's get it to 10k. What do likes do? Do they just like like the live? Come to Brazil, I want to. I love you. I love you guys. I'm trying to think, oh yeah, shoot, I'm gonna I'm being in a YouTube video today that you guys will see. So I'm stoked. Thank you, Christina. Come to Spain? Bro, I want to. Uh, I was supposed to go to Milan. And things just always fall through, man. They always fall through last minute. I was so pissed. Hi. Dude, shit. Should I just come everywhere? Let's do it. Do you guys want to see my... Sent TikTok universe to what's that? To not Jason. Do you guys want to see my gaming setup? You made an edit for me, yeah, guys. Run the edits up, man. I try to repost every edit I get. Let me show you all my setup at the moment. How do I flip this? There we go. Yeah, it's kind of, I mean, it's kind of scary. I have to, like, decorate it and stuff. But, like, it's pretty nice. Yeah, I translate, I translate the comments um, to understand what you guys are saying. Which is awesome that I'm able to do that. Because I feel like on Instagram, I can't translate. Unless I, like, type it in. That sucks. Yeah, bro, my PC's a beast. I got, if you guys are into computers, I got a, I have a 3080 and it's so nice. Like I, I'm running games at just like such high rates. Well, I love Vampire Diaries, so thank you. I don't use any specific products for my hair. It just like, right now this is my bed head. I'll show you. Oh, that's terrible. Oh, that's bad. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, it's like my empty, my empty ass apartment. You guys want to see it? Ew, bro. You guys want an apartment tour? Say yes if you want an apartment tour. Oh, he's back on, bro. I look terrifying. Yes. Okay. Okay. It's it's pretty it's pretty um, underdeveloped, I guess you could say. But I'll show you, it's pretty big for Los Angeles. So you walk in and then I have stuff to get stools. So I'm gonna get stools. I have to do the dishes too. So I'm gonna do the dishes. But then, oh yeah, the maintenance is currently fixing my heater. 
like system kind of thing so like this is like a portable heater because it got pretty cold this is my little cat stuff my vacuum nice kitchen got gaming setups living space i built that and it was pretty hard uh lamps cute there's my cat this dude this long ass cord and then down there that's my laundry room bathroom bedroom bedroom my bedroom's at the end kitty she hanging got a balcony we got the pool down there so yeah oh damn bro we hit 10k likes on here sick that was quick i don't really know what it does but cool what up skater girl you're cool yeah hi to hacker are you a Vinny hacker fan page my cat's names so this baby is my i love this kitty see this is suki suki hi say hi suki 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 oh she hears something something i don't know where the other little rascal is but she's also she's like the my other cat she's the crazy one and she's funny I love you, Andrea. Lots of I loves you. Ask, ask, drop some questions. I feel like I haven't been able to, like, I haven't been able to get too personal with you guys for like the past year. I don't, I don't know if you guys have like, I don't know how long you, the ones who are in here, have been following me. Um, like, when, when did you guys follow me, actually? Suki. Do you recommend living in LA? Uh, no, I don't. Um, for like a lot of reasons, honestly. And I don't wanna, I, I don't know who's in here and what your goals are um, or who you are. Uh, but it, it's, it's like a, it, it's a lie, dude. Like a lot of things out here are a lie. Like a lot of the things you see are a lie. Um, a lot of the friendships you see are a lie. Um, there's like, it, it's just like, dude, I've realized so much basically coming from a small town to coming to, um, big place you know with with a lot of successful wealthy um connected fake people and uh, i don't know man I, I i'm a new york guy i like new york and i've been i've been there twice now and i was just there and i absolutely love new york city and i feel like the if you guys haven't i don't know i don't know where you guys live or anything but How's the wait? How's the connection? I had to respond to a text. Yeah, dude. Um, New York is expensive, super expensive. I mean, we were just there, and like, we fortunately had our hotel comped. Um, we did just some like some brand work for for the hotel, and. Um, which was amazing. Like that, that was probably one of the best hotel experiences I've had. And I'm very blessed to have stuff like that, like compensated. Um, and it was, it was like, regardless, dude, I spent a lot of money and like, I was like, holy shit, like a lot of money on just food. And I was like, what? But I was also staying in Soho. Like, talk about a meal, bro. Like, everything you order, like a coffee, for God's sake. I would get, like, a coffee and a croissant, and it's, like, 15 bucks, like, every time. Is that not insane? Like, for a fucking coffee and a croissant, dude? Like, bro, 15 bucks? Ridiculous. 
yeah and then the whole dude hotel food is just like okay honestly that was the best room service i've ever had in my life like out of any hotel i've ever stayed and shout out modern house honestly genuinely i would pay to stay there it was amazing like the experience the ambiance the cuteness the restaurant the bar like everything was so nice i loved it so much what's up romina yeah thanks for sharing the live yo you guys should uh follow me for streaming too Honestly, dude, I'm just like, I, I don't eat like too much. I eat like, I eat just like, what's up? <laughs> um, I don't eat a lot, I drink a lot of coffee and like I eat probably like two good meals like a day. Um, nothing crazy. Yeah, I'm down. Just DM me on Instagram if you wanna shoot. Did the queen, <laughs> did the queen walk in? That's that is disclosed information. I cannot let you guys know that. <laughs> I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go talk to the um, talk near the Wi-Fi. Look. Oh wait. This is Onyx. Say hi, Onyx. Yeah, she's pretty. Tall. Oh. Onyx, baby, come here. Come here. Oh my goodness. Hang on. She's a. Oh, no. She's a crazy one. Oh, it's bright in here. She. She's talking to me. Yes. sitting close to me. But okay, that's the one thing, bro, about my apartment, is that the walls are metal, so, like, um, like, the Wi-Fi is really good. I pay 100, what, 130 bucks a month for Wi-Fi, and it's, like, super, like, the best Wi-Fi I could get for my location, and these fat-ass cords, I don't know if you guys were watching my little apartment tour that I was doing earlier, but these fat-ass cords that are 150 feet long, I have to circuit them to my computer because uh ethernet cords what the f yo anthony don't be shy and drop that hundred dollar gift bro <laughs> i'm just kidding i love you thank you for the rose homie i can't wait to see you in a few hours um but dude these fat ass freaking uh cords that go down the hall are my ethernet cords um but the wi-fi doesn't go through like this signal is really ass because I have metal walls, so. Oh my gosh, bro. Not him running me up with rope. I'm literally fangirling right now. I'm like totally fangirling. Is that Love Anthony in my life? Like I'm fanny, I've dreamed of this. Yo, it's your birthday. Happy birthday. Do a shoot with Ant. I'm down. Thank you. Who's my favorite cat? Okay. Like Onyx. Like I don't like Onyx the one that was just talking. Dude, like she's the got the biggest, fattest personality ever. But she is like probably the most like frustrating because like she she knows what she's doing, like she knows when she's being bad. That's fine. Is that a? F Do I have a? F this is a pimple on the tip of my nose, and you guys were not gonna tell me. Oh my. Boy. Dream career before modeling, bodybuilding pretty interesting what place do you recommend to live at like which complex or which like um like state 
Bro, the fact that I have a pimple on the tip of my nose, redon ridiculous. Favorite anime? Um, fuck, I've seen so many. Right now I'm watching Berserk, and I'm loving Berserk. So sick. Um, okay, like, it, it, it's corny, because, like, I feel like it's the most, like, watched, but I think the one that I actually connected with the most, and I had, like, watched so much of, was Naruto, truthfully. I feel like I got emotionally invested in, I got, emo, I've been emotionally invested in every other one I've done, like, watched, but, like, that one just hit dead for me. And I think I watched it years ago too. So like, it was just like a different time in my life. And it just like, it was just nice, honestly. I'm personally a Naruto fan. I'm a, I like, I liked Naruto more than Shippuden. What's up, Liz? You don't have the best skin and like, you, you can't change your skin overnight. You know, it's not like someone's making fun of your haircut. You could, you know, trim your hair, hair grows back out. But like, I mean, I got made fun of for my teeth. That was the fucking worst, especially before I had braces. That made me so insecure. It made me not want to smile, like nothing. And now I've just like learned to own it, bro. Like just own who you are. <clears throat> like you're cool. Like I think that's, I was just talking with um, an acting coach and she told me a lot of great things. And the one thing she told me that I loved and like stuck with me is you are interesting you as a person are the most interesting person and it, it's all confidence it, it's all perspective you know like and i don't know i just thought that was like if for some reason the way it was said to me and like the moment it was in I, when i needed to hear it i was like i was like damn you know that's actually like really cool you know you're you you're the only you and i feel like we compare each other like we compare ourselves to other people especially walking into a room going to on a, an audition in sports anything like that like you are you you're not them you guys are not all the same you have something way different to offer than anyone else does and i don't know i just thought that was like a, a better perspective to put things i was like damn you know i'm like i'm the only jordan huxley you know, I'm the only version of myself. Like, there's no one else like me. And and I, I just, like, took that advice from her. And I feel like I've been applying it to my life lately. And I'm way happier. I feel more confident. I feel from a different perspective. I'm caring less about, like, certain things. And it's just, like, it takes practice and rewiring your, your brain, you know? So, no, Jordan Huxhold is my actual name. I saved your life. I'm glad I was able to. I love you. Yeah, dude, y'all are beautiful, man. Go apply, like, go apply everything that you have to offer to your life and to your relationships and to anything you do. And I'm telling you, dude, that you'll you'll feel so much better about just like yourself in general and the perspective i mean like the scenarios you're in and stuff like that oh thank you yeah it's i mean it, it's an interesting last name everyone always thinks it's hux old and i'm like no dude it's like hux like h-u-x and then like you're holding something so hux hold that's how it's like pronounced my name is jordan alexander huxhold Yeah, of course. I feel the, I feel the, like, th that's the thing, dude, is that we're all the same, too. But, like, in, in perspective, we're all different but the same. And that's another perspective to take from things is that, like, we're, like, I'm, like, we all deal with similar things mentally. We all deal with insecurities. We all deal with stress. We all deal with anxiety. We all, we all get turned down. We all get, um, disregarded we get our feelings dismissed we get all these things just like taken you know just taken advantage of of you know one another um yeah 
Yeah. So I guess we're like, I don't know. Like, I think you should talk to each other as if you guys are, you know, uh, one to one. Every person you talk to, everyone's got a story. Everyone has sadness. Damn, boy, we hit 21,000 likes. You guys went crazy. Someone out here is tapping. <laughs> tapping in, man. Dude, I'm so down to have a coffee. Bro, I would love to have coffee with some of you guys. Like, I feel like the conversations we'll have are just like... Because I feel like um, with my... The, the people who follow me and that actually like sit here and listen and talk, I feel like we're all a, a lot more alike than than we all think so i feel like we're all more we're, yeah we're all more tapped in with each other you know a lot more tapped in with each other than you think i feel like we would all get along i feel like there's something you guys see in me that you see in yourself and you need to hear or you need to relate to or you relate to um and uh, yeah i feel like we're a lot more alike than you guys think Amo Fran. My model, yeah. Yep. I'm a signed contracted model. Um blessed to be signed. Uh it's super nice. Um but I'm working, still working towards being an actual model, you know? Still I've gone to all my cat I've gone to a lot of castings for runway, I haven't booked runway yet. Um I want I want you guys to like I feel like I, I'm t so tired of just sharing my successes like I want you guys to know that like dude like I struggle too man I get turned down in my life like I'm still the same Jordan as I was three years ago before I started doing any of this when I was living in a small town when I was living you know in my bedroom every fucking day like in my bedroom waking up like oh I need to make a TikTok oh I need to make a TikTok oh I need to make a TikTok oh I need to post oh I need to post I was always like and then like with all these goals and aspirations and wanting to be these kids here out in LA and you know, like wanting to just like be someone else. And as soon as I got out here and, and as soon as I started living my own life um, and, and meeting these people and meeting the people I wanted to meet and meeting the people I wanted to collaborate with and realizing that they're not really who you thought they were and you thought they were cooler and you really realized that like oh i was kind of looking up to someone who's not that nice of a person you know or like they're they're also sad or they're also you know asking for help and they you know there's like different different realms with things hey i love you lola your whole school is listening to me oh my gosh <laughs> in brazil Do I want to stream more on Twitch? Yeah, I'm going to stream. I'm going to try to stream later. I'm filming a YouTube video today. Not my YouTube video, but my friends. You'll see the collaboration. But I'm um, filming their YouTube video today with them in a couple hours. And then uh, I'm going to stream later because it's it's Friday. I'm chilling. Um, I'd, love to, I'd love to stream for you guys. So let's do it. When I go to Los Angeles, I live in Los Angeles. Bro, the streaming's hard. Like, I didn't realize that it's actually kind of like hard. It's like very uh, vulnerable because like, dude, when I'm playing video games and stuff and I'm like frustrated because I'm more of like a, I'm a gamer and I like to like, I'm really quiet and focused and then like I rage. So like, I don't know, I just love I love video games and streaming is hard for me because I feel like I'm, I have to be entertaining, even though that's, I probably, you know, I feel like people will just watch because they love the game or they just want to watch me. So I'm a Leo. Yeah. Can probably tell. What anime do I suggest? It depends on your mood, like what vibe you're in. If you're more into like a dark, if you want like more of a dark, energy like vibe like romance i'd say vampire night i feel like that's the most like comforting like anime it's really sick um i don't hang with Vinny a lot here and there we'll see each other or like chat
Yeah, the hair skips Leo, right? Yeah, man, I miss I miss my homies. Like, I wish they came around more. I just feel like everyone, like, everyone grew up and, and, and just, like, realized their passions and realized what they wanted and kind of just like that. That's how it works out here, man. What's TikTok universe? What's this notification I keep getting? Yo, yeah, thank you for the gifts, guys. Oh, the Jim Morrison, that's what my hair was inspired by, was Jim Morrison from The Doors. Um, I have a shag, my hair is cut as a shag. Do you ever get lonely in LA? Yeah. Yeah, very. You, I think the, I mean, luckily I have the best roommates ever. And we're all like best friends and we all actually like, are genuine and especially genuine with like what we like to talk about and how we feel about things and and how we are like staying inside or going out we, I don't know we just always are like there for each other and I'm blessed to have that because I haven't really had that before um, I just feel safe I feel safe here like where I live now I feel safe and it's not going anywhere it's raining a lot dude I wish it was raining here I love the rain Yeah, I have, I have had COVID, it sucked. You vote for me for presidency? <laughs> Dude, imagine. Do you ever feel sorry for something? Yeah, like, what do you mean by that? Because I, I feel sorry about a lot of things, truthfully. How do you get your curls to form well? Um, my curls started forming better when I, when my hair grew longer, um, and just like the right product and not like, uh, using good shampoo and conditioner. Conditioning is like what will keep your hair healthy, if you have healthy curls. Do I skate? Man, I haven't skated in forever, but yeah. The weather's beautiful. A new gifter. Is that, dang, these are like new things. New gifter. Anastasia. Thank you. Where's the best thing that you experienced living in LA? Um, I would say meeting new people. Meeting new people, starting my own life, um, paying my own bills, uh, all those things. I feel like that is what has been my best experience here. I've grown up, I've grown up here, truthfully. I went from a child, essentially, um, to an adult. You know, I, I've learned, I've, I've dealt with my, I feel like I've never, in my life, I've never cried this much. I've never felt this depressed. I've never um, had this much anxiety. I've never had anything like that. Yo, thank you for the confetti, Gigi. What, carnival? I live in California. Yeah. Thank you, listen. Damn, oh my gosh, almost 30k likes on here. Thank you. But yeah, dude, I, I haven't, um, I feel like I've, I've felt more emotions living here than I have anywhere else in my life. And, and being on my own and being in this place in my life, like I've accomplished so much. I've accomplished all my goals I wanted to accomplish in five years and a year. And now I'm like, at the point where I'm like, yo, like I need to catch up with my self externally, um, internally, you know, and that's the hard thing. I feel like that you guys will experience that if you haven't already, you will experience that in your life at some point when you get going on something and something's taking off for you or you're succeeding. Um, a lot of things come really quick and they can go away really fast. And I'm thankful that I think my biggest fear out here was getting blowing up like getting too big or getting like lucky and getting like that kind of um that kind of growth with just a bunch of people who follow you for one thing um I like I want to grow with my followers 
like with my supporters. I want you guys to see me succeed. I want to see you guys grow into the people you're gonna be, like stuff like that, you know? I wanna see us like, I, I want like my following my supporters to be a loyal, you know, a loyal following and to like appreciate who I am as a person and not because I just do something, you know? Yeah, I'm starting, I'm starting acting um, in April. Uh, I have like some, some, I'm going to be doing a lot of acting courses and classes and all that stuff. Mainly to get uh, more in tune with myself. I feel like acting, it, it brings you a side of confidence and vulnerability that you can reconnect with yourself. Beautifully said. I think portraying other characters helps you distinguish your own characteristics. Yeah, I agree. Yes, I'm going to stream soon. Carnival in Brazil? Bro, I'm down. Yeah, yeah, do I, ever, do I ever have trouble with comparing myself to others? Yes, I do. Um, I, I mean, not lately, uh, maybe lately. I feel like we all do, yeah. Yeah, I feel like, um, I feel like I compare myself a lot. Uh, and I, I shouldn't, you know, like, I'm like, oh, like, why am I not that successful yet? Or, you know, why am I not booking that job? Or why, you know, like, I, I, I definitely compare myself to others. Yeah, that's normal. I might stream CSGO, honestly. Oh, I think my boots, guys, I got these crazy boots today. I think I just got them because I just got the parcel notice. Bro, I bet the Brazilian parties are the best. No, I have a lot. Wait, can you guys tell me what that is? Six, seven cent TikTok universe, two rows? What is that? Are you guys able to gift each other? I'm not sure how the gifting on here works, but I'll follow back the top gifters. The I'll follow back the top gifter at the end of the live, I think is right. Dude, this app has become like, this is upgraded so much from the last, from like when I used to actually go live on here a lot. It used to be like drama queen. I'm very rich. Follow, follow, add on snap. I deleted Snapchat by the way. You met me through a fanfic, but it wasn't about you. What was it about? I'm good today. I feel good today. I feel happy. It feels awesome to talk to you guys. I like feeling connected with you guys. Not dis. I don't like feeling disconnected. No, don't worry. You're in school watching me. What are you guys doing in school right now? Are all of you guys in school? You wanna play CSGO and Valorant with me? Um, what's my, my CSGO, you guys can add me on, on Twitch. I mean, not Twitch, what? On Steam, I need to change my tag though. Cause right now it's like private. Do I miss my old friends? Which, which ones? It's your first live, but it feels good to talk to you. It feels good to talk to you. Bye, Liz. Are you going to school? <laughs> Getting back to school. Thank you for the rose, Anna. Thank you. Yeah, shout out Brazil. I definitely will be in Brazil. I will definitely will come. Do I miss Vin? Yeah, man. I miss my, yeah. I miss my bros. Like I said, I wish I wish we all hung out more. I feel like I need that. I feel like we all need it. Is 
is LA fun as it is portrayed or does it have an evil side? It has an evil side. It does. Um, it's fun, and but you'll realize that it's repetitive. It's the same parties. It's the same thing. It's drinking, 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 drinking. Uh, just lots of partying, man, and like a lot of a lot of rich for nothing people who are just loaded. Everyone just rich um, and bored. You're bored. It's boring pretty boring here um i liked and and the people here are not honestly bro like the majority of the people here are not that nice to be honest like i liked new york when i was in soho i loved everyone was so nice the style was immaculate the conversation was beautiful the way people come up to you and just like compliment you or be like hi like hey like oh my gosh so sorry da 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 i loved it i loved the ambiance of fucking new york it was so nice and uh, and here dude you go here like i don't know if i'm gonna get like attacked walking down hollywood if i'm gonna get jumped like stuff like that like it's honestly scary especially if you have if you have the citizens app man freaking scary yo anna thank you so much for the roses am i excited for the last episode of euphoria hell yeah I'm so excited. Newest tattoo. It's the one on my arm. I don't want to pull up my sleeve right now. You guys can look on my Instagram, though. I feel like there are no real personality in LA. It's all for media. Yep. And like I said, not everyone's actually friends. Believe it or not. Would I fight Cassie? Dude, I would never fight a woman. What the heck? Hi, Maria. Sophia from Brazil. The bracelet, yeah. This was actually my mom's when she was a kid. So it's like my good luck bracelet, is how I think about it. I always I, I always have this on. It's my good luck bracelet. Um, this was sent. I love this chain, though. Beautiful chain. I was blessed to have this gifted to me from Clocks and Colors. It's beautiful. Love it. You have a crush on me? Oh my gosh. Well, I love you. Thanks. Thanks for having a crush on me. You have nice teeth. Thank you. Dude, yeah, you think I'm telling... <laughs> Who's who said that? Amanda? Bro. Yeah. Is LA expensive? Yeah. So expensive. Like, Ubering somewhere. If I have to Uber, what, 20 minutes away, it's like 40 bucks. I'm like, dude, I don't have a car. So, like, I just Uber everywhere. So, like, most of the time I just stay inside because I'm like, dude, I'm not going to, like, it's so easy to casually spend $300 on nothing. It's pretty insane. How do I feel about my fans saying I love you? If you mean it, I love you too. If you half mean it, I still love you. I think it's great. I think, like... If that's how you want to express yourself, express it. It's cool. Bro, I love all of you. If you're in here, I love you. Favorite fashion trend, fur boots. Which, those are the shoes I got. So, I think they're here. You know, I, I, think, I think certain scenarios, such as like living somewhere, I, I think it either... It, 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 things don't change you. It's the same thing with money. Johnny Depp said, money doesn't change you, it reveals you. I think same thing with places. Moving to a more toxic place, it doesn't change you, it reveals you. That's how I would, that's how I would perceive things, you know? Like, um, you'll, if you're just not about it and you're not toxic and you're not into that shit, then dude, you're gonna sit inside and you don't wanna go anywhere. You just like stick to your own stuff, you know? If you fall more into like, if you're more influenced and you don't know who you are yet, then yeah, you know, you'll be, you're, you not knowing that will be revealed. My favorite body part, probably my, probably my arms because I use them the most. No, my legs. I love my legs because I use them the most. Get a buzz cut. Dude, I would never post again. 
it can affect you yeah i mean and, and especially being crossed yeah i'm not saying it you i'm not saying 100 percent it won't affect you i feel like in the beginning it just reveals you who you actually are whole edit xxx shout out you i love you show you my hair routine i can do a little maybe i'll do a live video on my hair routine for you guys because it's pretty simple it's like not even worth a video honestly where am i from i was born and raised in florida Cocoa beach like cape canaveral which is um i was born in the cape canaveral hospital which is basically where nasa is which is pretty cool My naturally blonde? Yeah, this is my natural hair color. Uh, I wouldn't consider myself being famous. Um, I would say, what, like, popular on TikTok. I mean, I do have people who take photos with me. Um, I mean, I, I, I love it. I love, like, I love, I don't love being famous, but I'm not, fa I'm not famous, though. Um, I love the i love attention i like attention it's cool uh, and do i get uncomfortable like in public when people ask for photos or anything like that no i think it's fun i think it's cool cute people like do that or that i've inspired them in a way of some sort i think it's cool Thank you. Yeah, I need to work out more. Mainly just to feel better. What's my relationship with my parents? Great. I feel like um, I've always had an amazing leadership in my life and uh, guidance. Um, oh wait, Wiggy, thank you for the gift. Um, but I always had amazing leadership in my life and great parents and people who love me. And I've always been surrounded by a ton of love and I'm so, I was blessed for that too. I was lucky to have that. Um, I feel like I didn't appreciate it as much as I should have growing up, you know, when you have more protective parents. I mean, they weren't like overly protective, but they were cool. Um, and they accept me for who I am. And they, uh, just, you know, um, they want me to chase my dreams. And I think that's cool. I've been to the Caribbean. Pretty sure I've been in the Caribbean, yeah. What's up, Daniel? Dude, if you're from Brazil, say I. Because I actually want to know. Wait, I'm waiting. So no one's from no one's from Brazil? Or say yes. You guys listening if you're from brazil say yes or i i just want to see from morocco oh that's fire dirty secret thank you for the arcade game that's cool hall edit i love you from sweden crazy Money gun, dirty secret. Thank you. Thank you for the cool gifts. I love the new uh, emotes those have. There's fire. Dude, these are dope. Thank you for the cat. I love cats. So thanks. Uh, who said that you're recording the screen? Hi, Sophia. Thank you for the roses. Dirty Secret, man. You're the Dirty Secret. What the heck? Favorite series? Uh, probably probably Gossip Girl. Vampire Diaries. Blonde Finn Wolfhard? Bro, I wish. He has such an awesome look, man. He's so talented. Skin routine? Uh, I, I, not really anything. I apply moisturizer and I wash my face with water. That's it. Would I ever come to Ireland? Yeah, Ireland's look, Ireland looks beautiful. Liv, I love you and Martina. 
Liz, I love you and Martina. You love cats too? Me too. I love cats. Oh my gosh, almost 40,000 likes on here? Dope. This is fun, bro. The live on here is so much more fun now. I like that it's more interactive. It's sick. Oh, I do apply sunscreen. Yeah. What places do you want to go in Brazil? Um, Rio. Looks really cool. Twerk, bro, please. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, right. I could do my little trend that I had Maddie and Baron do. I've never watched Grey's Anatomy. Favorite video game? Uh, Minecraft. Do I plan on acting? Yeah. Down the road, yeah. I think, I, I mean, I, I'm definitely pursuing that, so, like, you guys will hopefully see me in things. I'm manifesting. Kananda? Kananda? Hello, Kananda. I think, I, I, hope, you, I hope I said your name right. Can you make, yeah, make us matching rings. Do I brush my hair? I do in the shower. When did someone hurt you the most? Um, hmm. I don't know. A lot. Just like, I don't know, certain things. I don't know, I don't have a specific one. Yo, thanks for following. So we got new, new viewers in this live? Hey, hey, hey. What's up, Kaden? Am I real? Yeah, I'm pretty real. Again, shout out Reckless Scholars. I wanna, I'm gonna make a video, like an alpha video with his clothes. He's sent me, dude, Eli from Reckless Scholars. He's a homie, actually like not paid, nothing. He is like, I love his clothes and he always hooks it up. He's been hooking it up for me for two years now. I remember seeing his stuff years, like, like a couple years ago before I was like really on social media at all and I was like, and I was like, oh my gosh, like this dude's shit is so sick. And now we're like friends and he's cool and he hooks me up with like, man, he just, he just recently sent me the coolest freaking backpack and like stuff. His stuff's so fire, dude. Reckless Scholars on Instagram. He's sick. He's very sick. Check him out. Hi, Aisha. I love you. Top three music artists. Uh, the Neighborhood, Joji, um, Kid Cudi. No, don't worry about it. You guys do not have to give gifts at all. That is simply up to you. I appreciate them. But you do not have to. I love you. What kind of music do I like? I'm more into like chill, chill, grungy music, I feel like. I don't know. I just like music in general. It just depends on my mood, honestly. Thank you guys. Guys, I'm gonna hop off the live though. Um, this was awesome. I, th I feel like this was one of my favorite lives I've had actually. So thank you for coming in and listening. Um, I'll definitely be doing this again. I'm gonna try to post in a few or maybe later, maybe I'll uh, post with some friends. Um, but I love you guys. Make sure to stay. If you got like, <clears throat> I'm trying to think. Yeah, I don't know. Do you guys have my notifs on for TikTok when I post? Because if you do, let's run run it up, run it up. I want to get back in the. I want to get back in my groove on here. And just start like 
interacting again and posting more. I just, like, don't... I don't know. I feel like I was uninspired. And now I'm, like, happy again. And now I'm, like, excited to, like... Wait, actually, before I end the live, let's hit 40k likes. Run it up, fellas. 40k, please. I don't know what it does, but it just looks cool, so... Run it up, fellas. Run it up. Talk with you in Discord? Oh, I will. I'm gonna post, guys... Go to my Instagram after I hop off live. Follow me on Instagram. But I'm going to post on my story in a few. My Discord link. So. Bro, Nikki did not. What? Okay. I love you guys. But go. Thank you for 40k. Yeah. But uh, I'm going to be posting my Discord. So join my Discord. And I'm going to stream later. And we'll do all that. Because if you guys are already in my Discord, then you're chilling. And we'll, I'm going to chat more on there. So, yeah. I love you guys. Don't cry. Have a good day. Um, be positive And... Uh,